This is A, who lives with their parents. This is their father, mother, and grandmother. They live in Village A, and that's the chief of Village A. This is B. She lives with her parents. This is her father, mother, and grandfather. They live in Village B, and that's the chief of Village B. From the outside, do you know what's different about groups A and B? No, right? The difference is O guard. Mr. B can leave for work at his full-time job. Mrs. B can spend time working for extra income to help her husband. Because their child B, even with a disability, can live independently. She can make an income and contribute financially to her family. She can access and afford health and rehabilitation services. And she has a wheelchair and crutches, which help optimize her function. She can access community facilities like schools, village meeting halls, and temples. She can join sports or other events and meet with friends and other community members, which helps her feel positive about her life and have more confidence. Wow, that sounds awesome. I wish I could have the same Ogard as them. How can I live independently with my health condition? Of course, everyone can have the same Ogard. First, you need a good understanding of your health condition and confidence to go to the hospital and seek support from trained professionals. A health professional will assess your function, provide treatment, give you the right assistive product, and might show you exercises to do at home or advise you how to make adjustments around your home to make it easier to move and do activities. Oh, oh. our grandma finds it hard to move around the house and can't hear when we talk to her. Can she also get help? As people get older, rehabilitation can help them too. Rehabilitation is for all, not just persons with disabilities. Medical rehabilitation is important. We still have a limited number of qualified health professionals in rehabilitation. So, the Center of Medical Rehabilitation and the OGARD Project have set up a professional development training program for health professionals to learn and have a true understanding of examination, diagnosis, and appropriate assistive products that meet the needs of persons with difficulty in functioning. It's hard. I had to carry him most of the time when we didn't have the wheelchair. He couldn't sit by himself. Now he's happy to have the wheelchair. His friends say, Sunkarn, you have a cool wheelchair. He is so happy now. Peer-to-peer -peer support can increase your confidence and skills by talking to someone else who has been in a similar situation as you. When you share experiences with another person, you can feel stronger and more able to say what you need and do what you want. After joining the peer-to-peer -peer program, I'm glad to have made many new friends and learned new things. I learned what I never knew before from a friend, such as how to exercise and share our experiences. The project taught me how to walk with a white cane. The OGARD project gave me a new life. It has strengthened me and cheered me up. I help teach blind people, those who have the same condition as me. I cheer them up, give them opportunities, and teach them how to walk. If you feel low or sad, a trained doctor can support you with counseling. You have the right to access quality health and rehabilitation services by trained professionals. You can read about it in the disability law. This can improve your function, well-being, and enable you to live more independently. Everyone is responsible for working together to break down barriers and promote inclusion so that everyone can participate and contribute to the community equally. Let's break 
Guard is for everyone. 